Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. In today's video, I'm going to provide you with a light version of BlueStacks. And along with that, I'll demonstrate running the latest Free Fire update OB43 on it. You can use this version of BlueStacks, even on a 2GB in fact, 1GB RAM PC without any graphics card. And as you can see on the screen, the gameplay is incredibly smooth. In this Android emulator, you'll have access to Android 4. And speaking of its size, it's just 200 MB. So let's start the video. So I've now come to my PC screen. First, let me show you the specifications of my PC to clear any doubts regarding the system requirements. As you can see, my PC has only 2 GB of RAM and a 2.40 GHz processor. Now, let me show you the GPU. Here you can see I have a 64 MB Intel HD graphics card, which is not very powerful. Now, let's move on to the installation process. The link to download this application can be found on my website, and you can access the website through the description of my channel. As for the size, it's just 200 MB. Simply double-click on the application and launch it. After launching the application, you'll see an interface like this. Below, there's a button where you can change the installation directory of the emulator. After changing the directory, click on the Install button, and the installation will start. It will take around 5 to 10 minutes, so let's wait for a bit. 2,000 years later. So, our installation is now complete. Now uncheck this box and click on this button. After that, right-click on the BlueStacks icon and choose the Run as Administrator option. The first time you launch it, it may take 5 to 10 minutes to start, and it can take even longer if your PC is slow. In the next step, you simply need to log in with your Google account. As you can see, the emulator has successfully launched and is running quite smoothly. This version of BlueStacks also comes with its own app store, from where you can easily download and install games. Speaking of its Android version, it's Android 4, which is the reason it works quite smoothly on low-end PC. If you go into the settings, you'll find that all the options are already configured. For example, I have only 2 GB of RAM in my PC, so it has automatically allocated 800 MB. If you have 1 GB of RAM, it will allocate 512 MB automatically, ensuring a smooth experience without any lag. So, let's quickly install Free Fire. To install Free Fire, you simply need to click on this button below, select your Free Fire PK, and the installation will start. Now that our Free Fire is installed, let's test it. While Free Fire is launching, please like the video. And if you're interested in Windows or software-related content, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. As you can see, Free Fire is installed, and it's running smoothly without any lag on my system. Let me know in the comments how you find this emulator. If you face any problems, feel free to contact me on Facebook or Instagram. The links are in the description. Also, if you're interested in installing Android 12 OS on your PC, check out this video, and I'll see you there. Goodbye.